The future of transport efficiency. We are in the year 2025. The number of large urban agglomerations is growing and so is goods traffic. Resources are in ever shorter supply, the traffic space is more congested and the environmental regulations are stricter. Zero emission zones and other entry restrictions in our inner cities require new vehicle concepts while high fuel costs demand more efficient transport systems. Roads subject to dense traffic need new safety precautions. Come and see how goods will be moved in the year 2025. Goods are transported around the globe almost exclusively in containers. Here we see a container ship arriving at its port of destination. The containers, each of which is fitted with a GPS module and a retrievable data memory, are automatically directed to the correct transport channels. A modular long truck is directed to a loading point, where it takes on the cargo. The truck is equipped with a new combination of standard loading units. The higher load capacity of the modular long truck means that in total fewer vehicles are required for goods transport. That leads to a significant reduction in fuel consumption and in CO2 emissions. The modular system ensures that the containers can be loaded onto rail transportation systems too, just as they are today. The transport manager at the forwarder's depot consults his computer to check the allocation of the containers, the condition of the goods, the safety of the vehicle, the fuel reserves and much more besides. The truck is given an identification tag. That means that all information on the goods and on the vehicle can be saved here and accessed. The optimum route is calculated. The distance, the volume of traffic, the CO2 output and the tolls are recorded. Space is reserved at parking areas along the way. The system suggests the most economical route. Thanks to secure GPS-assisted communication systems, the forwarder, shipper and recipient of the goods always know the vehicle's position to within a metre and the condition of the cargo. The intelligent systems in the vehicles communicate with each other too. In this way, safety is considerably improved. For example, by monitoring the lateral areas of the vehicle as it joins the traffic flow on the motorway. Traffic jams too are identified like this at an early stage. The navigation system diverts the modular long truck individually to the most favourable alternative route. Resulting changes in tolls are automatically recalculated by the system. The engineering of the vehicles and new technologies, such as optimised aerodynamics, lightweight construction or a GPS-based shifting strategy, lead to major fuel savings. Other contributions to these savings come from intelligent logistic systems or targeted driver training. The vehicle is now approaching the outer zone of its destination area. The distribution centre is automatically informed of the expected time of arrival. An unloading space is allotted to the vehicle and the goods are transferred to smaller distribution trucks. All of this is automatic. The container's destination data is loaded into the system in the distribution trucks. The optimum route to the destination is calculated fully automatically. In dense traffic, communication between the vehicles is very important. The system in the distribution truck will, for example, record the signal from a vehicle breakdown on the other carriageway and warn oncoming traffic of the obstacle. The distribution truck's destination is another distribution centre on the edge of the inner city. This is where the green zone with its special environmental regulations begins. From here, hybrid trucks or electric vehicles bring the shipments to the recipients in the city centre. As it moves into the zero emission zone, the hybrid truck switches over to full electric drive. Driver assistance systems also ensure extra safety in dense inner city traffic. When they arrive at the customers, the goods are finally subjected to an automatic goods inward check. The goods have arrived, safe and sound, fast, reliably and with maximum relief for the environment and resources.
innovative technologies are MAN's contribution to transport efficiency in the future.